Welcome back to another video fam You're gonna learn something new today isn't it? Something that's never been on this channel before Or on YouTube In the entire world How to trap All you man are, are going on, on, on YouTube looking at drill music Oh I wanna trap Yeah yeah man get the packs and that oh, oh. Go to their friends and that oh, I got three bags this week yeah My brother's in, in, in been in that He, he sent me his line in that fam But hear what yeah None of that bullshit. I'm not gonna give you the real spill, innit? You come here to figure out a way to make money illegally, innit? Yeah? I don't care if this thing gets demonetized or something like that. Alright, let's start off, yeah? A couple reasons, yeah? Why you shouldn't be doing this shit. Especially when you're at a young little age and that, and you're thinking you're bare hard and that because you listen to all this music, gets you up and that, yeah? You need to know the reality, fam. It's not a nice world outside, yeah? Watch this. Alright, view man, yeah? Are oh, too good of a person. You're not willing to go this, that, this, that, do this. You know, you haven't got the heart to do that, yeah? You shouldn't be on this video. You shouldn't even be fucking trying to research how to trap. It's, it's not for you, innit? You care about your family. You care about your, 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 you. You care about your, your galley and that. You care about your dog, yeah? Or your fucking cat. Stay out of this fucking video, innit? Go, go home, do some books. Or look at some ne next real estate thing. Alright, so you kids here are thinking, oh, I've been listening to this man and, and these dons are going, oh, I do this, I flip that, blah, blah, they make it sound easy, innit? What you're about to learn is, it's not even hard, yeah, it's harder than hard, yeah, it's, it's nowhere near easy. So don't think, oh, because someone's talking about this, yeah, half the time they're chatting shit, fam. So you guys here think you're going to step in the first week, yeah, and make bare peas. And then some of you won't make no shit or even step out your house, yeah, and we'll go run into your mix. Start chatting, oh, yeah, I done this, I made this. Oh, look at me, I'm on job now. Oh, I lost my line in that. Oh, my, my, my line's gone, man. I've got to get a new one, man. Oh, it's a hell of a... Now they're chatting shit, man. The first week, you're thinking, oh, I have no money. I have no money to even buy a fucking Q or a free fire. So what do you do? You go and consign, yeah? You're gonna go to a, a fucking plug. I beg you give me this, man. I'll pay you back in that, man. Oh, please, man. I'll pay, I'll pay you back, fam. I just need this. Just bust me, innit? Bust me and I'll, I'll get the piece right back to you, innit? Nah, that's not how it's gonna work. You're gonna think oh, it's all Gucci and that. You're gonna take the pack. You're gonna start bagging it up. You're gonna thinking, oh, what the fuck, is, what the fuck am I doing? You're gonna start doing by eye. You're gonna start bagging shit by eye and you're gonna think, oh, oh, where's my money gone? And if you're a needy, yeah, you be smoking it. What you're gonna be doing, you're gonna be smoking all your fucking weed and making no money. You're, you're smoking your money. You spent money. You even spend money. You got yourself in debt first, yeah? You smoked your money or you, you, you didn't bag it properly and you're selling it for less, yeah? You're selling more for less. The hardest bit, you're gonna go out, you're gonna start searching for people. You're gonna come up to someone like, You want some jewels, man? What? No. Oh, you smoke? You smoke cigarettes? Uh. Oh, can, can I have some uh, spare cigarettes? Do you smoke jewel, by the way? Oh, uh, no, man, not even. If you're lucky, yeah? Oh, yeah, 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 sure, mate, sure, mate. <laughs> you got anything on, on you now? Okay, so what are, you gonna, what are you gonna do in that situation when you find the first catty, yeah? The first nitty you find, yeah? Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, I'm gonna buy some weed. You're gonna give it to him, and sometimes he might go, Oh, oh I haven't got that much. Oh, can I tick you? Can I kick you? And you're thinking, oh yeah, take us calm, man, you'll pay me back in it. They won't pay you back, fam. They will cut. They've only met you once. Why are you gonna send them a tick? Your first deal, yeah, you sell one one fucking bend or something or ball or whatever. Yeah, say so you get your first pack gone. And then if you're lucky, this is gonna take months or even half a year or whatever. Depends how much effort you're putting in. If you're, if you're willing to do this, you're gonna be outside every single day, 24s, and you'll sleep at fucking 3 a.m., 4 a.m. or whatever. Get up and do the same shit again. It's the most boring lifestyle you'll ever fucking have in your whole life. Being outside, looking for people, selling some dumb fucking piece of grass, in it. That's the most boring shit. And you think everyone's having a nice life doing that, yeah? Everyone will tell you, oh, I'm bored fam, I wanna do something else fam, I wanna get out of the ends fam, I wanna get peas fam, blah blah blah. In this cycle, you're never, ever, ever, ever gonna get rich or weed, innit? You're gonna do that if you start moving up in the, in the, in the tears and that, but that's gonna take some heart. 
that's gonna take some dedication to actually take someone's life and that. That's how you get up. And half, most people aren't on that. They'll say they are, but most people aren't on that kind of liabilities they're taking in it. They don't wanna go prison. They don't wanna lose their loved ones. You know what I'm saying? Like, they don't wanna take their life. This is your own cause, innit? This is a, a video to give you the right information before you even step or even think about doing something, innit? So, take this into heart. Think, oh yeah, this guy, I'll oh, listen to him. Oh, no, he's just chatting shit. Nah, you need to listen, innit? Say you start getting customers, yeah? Stay, say you start getting bad people in your line and all that bullshit. You've been out for a long time. People start getting to know you. And then every single street you're on, I guarantee you there's at least at least one dealer. Someone will get pissed about, oh, you're taking my competition, man. Oh, who's this, man? Why is he taking my caps? Whoa, 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 whoa. That's what happens. Business is business, isn't it? People are gonna start fucking taking weapons to you, trying to, trying to break down your business, trying to break down you. Or even if they're actually fucked in the head, they might, might even try to kill you, innit? And if you retaliate and do something peak, then it's gonna go in a cycle. Say people are gonna start respecting you because you're doing this and that, but one time you're gonna get touched from. And you're not gonna risk your life over a piece of grass, innit? Like there's so many better ways to make peace. But this ain't the video for that. You're itching. I know you're itching for that bullshit. Someone's come up to you and said, oh, run this for me and you'll make a couple, couple bags, you know what I'm saying? And more time than just chatting shit. If you want to do something like this, you have to build it yourself from scratch. From scratch. You buy a fucking phone, you get a SIM, you top it up, you go outside, on a pushback, on your feet, or whatever transportation you got, you go to parks, go to people you know, you, you stay in your fucking lane. Don't go into some, some next territory and get yourself fucking stabbed up and that. That's not the way to go in it. You stay in your own fucking ends. You do what you gotta do. You let people know what you're doing, yeah? If they have problems with it, you face it up, yeah? You let people know what you're doing so you're not going, oh, 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 I'm shot behind your back and I'm not taking your cats. Because it will get worse, innit? So, if you become a runner for someone, you'll get in debt instantly. They'll give you their shit. They, they, they demand you to take all the peace from everyone they ask you to go to and they demand you to have that money back to them. If you fuck up, if I finesse this is car, nothing's gonna happen to me. He won't even know. He'll know everything, man. The guy will know everything about what you're doing, where you're going. He will speak to the people that you, you sold it to, whatever. There's no way of getting out of it. So you got even if you do everything by the book, the guy will fuck you over. That's what he's there for, he's there to make money, don't care about your life, whatever. Don't do run if you're gonna be in this shit, you gotta do it yourself, innit? The next thing I'll talk about is OT. You guys are getting twisted, fam. Twisted, especially twisted, man. The first thing I'm gonna talk about first before that, yeah? You might think you can get out of the game, innit? Once you're in there, and once you're actually doing good, once you're making peace from that, you're successful, there isn't a way out. Everything you've done in that past will come back to you, if you move on, you get a family, it will come back to them. If you, 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 you lose your job, you're thinking, oh, I'll just go back to that, blah, blah, blah. You're gonna, it's a cycle, that's why it's called trap. You're stuck in a trap. Nobody knows this fucking meaning, but that's the meaning of it. You're stuck in a trap. People fucking, people up higher up, they made that term because they know there isn't a fucking way out and people are 40, 50, still fucking trapping, still selling drugs because they don't know other ways to get peace and if they leave, they're gonna have people this, that, this, that. Especially if you're, if you're running for someone or your, your, your plug is providing you with massive amounts of shit, they're gonna get pissed off saying, oh, I lost this guy, man, he's sick, man, he got me bare peas, now I lost him, I've got to bring him back. Or they're gonna get selfie and then start trying to, you know, create beef with you, innit? So that's what's gonna happen. That's what I mean by you can't get out. Maybe if you go to a different country and that and never show up again, you're blessed, innit? But whatever. The next thing I'm gonna talk about is all out of town and that, yeah? Out of where you live, the city, out of the city, the countryside, you know, they call it country, yeah? The countryside, the places where there's not much competition, but there will be every single place. This is what this place, this, the, the, everywhere has come to, innit? 
Every single place, no matter how white the place is or how posh the place is, there is always competition. And that's something I learned personally, innit? You need to stop this, I'm gonna go OT, I'm gonna make bare peas and come back. You're gonna come back six months, a year later, man. It's not a one month thing. And when it's in the OT, when you're out of the fucking town, less CCTV, less security, less police, more bullshit goes on. People see the dirtiest fucking things ever. Most people are, being, are gonna be living with nitties, living in their houses. They're gonna be fucking asking for samples 24s and that. Uh, oh, I'll give you a little tick. Oh, uh, uh, uh. There's not the shit you wanna be dealing with every day, waking up, not even washing, whatever. Like, depends where you are, depends what your situation is. Shit gets peak out there, and you're thinking, oh yeah, just make a quick couple bags and that, man, come back home and that, you know what I'm saying? No, it's not gonna happen, innit? And no one gets this point. Everyone is glorified by this fucking dual music or whatever's going on with their friends. Like, they're not showing no pudding, no proof, nothing, yeah? And then you're falling into it like, yeah, yeah, it's calm. A lot of people catch on and think, oh yeah, this guy's trying shit, he's not about that. You just rented your whip. You haven't, you haven't made that off track. Or, you know what I mean? All these people that are doing dual music and doing quite well and people, if they know for a fact they're not doing, they're not on that stuff, yeah? They're not getting, like, the shit they have is not from trap, yeah? They've probably done it in the past. They probably, you know what I'm saying, like, it's, most of it is from their audience, yeah? If you have an audience, you can make the most amount of money you can ever fucking dream of. Audience brings everything. Affiliate marketing, fucking YouTube ads, like, there's so many ways you can just, if you promote one thing, you get paid for it. There's so many deals going on, there's so many shit from music, so many peas coming in different kind of ways, and you're only thinking one thing, oh this guy's making peas of trap. That's not the case, man. You gotta stop this glorification, yeah, of everything you've been hearing or seeing. That's just Okay, so I've told you guys, yeah, the downsides, the reason why not to do it, how to do it, you know what I mean, buy a phone, like a sim, whatever, you know, go outside, find people. Network with people, you know, get customers, do a couple of deals, don't get your phone tapped by the police, don't get baited, stay stay incognito like me in it. When you when you go older, you're gonna realise all the shit you've been thinking about is, is bullshit. Like so many people will grow out of one thing, some people grow out of this, that. You know, I've grown out a lot of things in it. I'm still rolling on different shit every fucking day. I want to know what your fucking opinions are below in the comments thinking oh you turn my, my head around i'm not gonna do it or yeah i might go in and fucking do this i don't care what you're saying you're a fucking prick you know on shit like man's not trying to prove nothing in that i'm just trying to tell you like to to just know some knowledge in your head before you stop taking dumb actions in your brain and that like, come on man it's your life on the end of the of the bridge and it's you want to jump jump in it it's not my problem I'm just trying to give advice. So, if you guys want to see more advice, like videos and shit, like this video, comment down below, tell me what problems, what questions you have, and I'll, I'll come through, yeah. I'll come through, I'll lay out the advice. I know a lot of shit going on it. Man's been through, I'm not gonna tell you my age, in it, but I'm going through a lot of shit right now. People are going through a lot of shit right now. I can give knowledge, or other people can give knowledge. Like I could just make videos about your problems, innit? And yeah, subscribe to me, cause more shit's gonna be coming. I'm not gonna be one of these guys just making fucking talking videos, 24s and that. I'm a fun ton. So you're coming to this channel for more shit than you're asking for, innit? Yes. Don't get all sorry. Oh, this guy's random. He doesn't keep to what he's doing, and that. I'm gonna have to subscribe. I'm subscribed because he's not sticking to one thing. Go up, fam. Why do you wanna stick to one thing? You only live once, innit? Alright, peace.